Two shootings in less than 24 hours just this morning. A traffic stop turned deadly on a busy stretch of Pin Road on the city's west side. Two people were killed, two others injured, including a San Antonio police officer. Police Chief William McManus says that officer was forced to take out his service weapon and open fire to protect himself. The night team's Patty Santos was at the scene where witnesses describe what happened. The way they did it was coward because he wasn't even, I, I think if he would have made it up to the front window of the driver's side, they would have shot him point blank right there. The woman who captured this video says she was recording a traffic stop when she saw it. San Antonio police officer nearly killed. She called 911 before she started rolling. It's sad that people had to die, but they didn't give that policeman a chance. We were here talking about the traffic stop. About a block away, Jorge Velasquez says he thought he was watching a usual traffic stop here at this four-way on Pin Road and Westfield Boulevard, known for pullovers. We thought they killed the officer. He then watched the officer take cover behind his patrol car and shoot back about eight times, he thinks, but silence from the truck. By the time he got close enough, he says the suspects were dead and a woman was on the sidewalk injured. The officer was covered in blood. Another officer took him to the hospital. What these witnesses say resembles what San Antonio Police Chief William McManus says he saw on the officer's dash camera video. He says it was a casual traffic stop until the driver pulled a gun. The passenger and the driver were both shot. Uh, they are both deceased and the third passenger was transported to the hospital. Uh, shot in the upper torso. The officer was shot in the hand and another bullet landed on his radio. A swarm of police units covered the scene for hours. Witnesses say it was eye-opening. I can honestly say like this, I have a new respect for them. Patty Santos, KSAT 12 News.